Hello everybody. So as I'm getting ready to plan for next week, which is May 29th through June the 4th, 2017, I wanted to get real with you and kind of show you last week's plans, what went well, what didn't go well. Um, kind of keep it real. I, I know people, you see all these beautiful planners and I'm not saying mine was, especially not last week. I was trying some new things. Um, and you see what they're planning on doing and you think, wow, they've really got it together. They know what's going on. And, and so last week, got derailed quite a bit it got derailed um i had a friend who unexpectedly needed to go to the medical center for some doctor stuff and she needed a ride and so i took wednesday morning i took that off and i went with her and um then of course it went even though it was a morning appointment it went into the afternoon and i didn't get anything done that day really that i wanted to get done you could see i've checked things off but they happened on different days they didn't happen this day friday i had some kids that had some um, situations and they were texting me and calling me all morning and not that they weren't important things they were but um, you know I've sort of set myself some business hours and some goals and other people's stuff took priority over it last week and and I need to be better about that um, my son-in-law's dad was ill and he needed me to take him to the airport Sunday so that's my Sunday morning was taken up with that I only worked out twice the yoga did not happen. The weight work happened, but only twice. Um, some things, it just they just didn't get done. Um, the week got sort of, it wasn't the way I planned it to go. And I'm not going to lie to you. There was a day, I think it was Thursday or Friday afternoon, that I just sort of had a mini meltdown. I was like, you know what? I told people this is a priority for me. I really told myself this is a priority for me. And it's not happening. And it, it just upset me. And so, but we're starting a new week and we're going to give it a go again. And I'm going to really get my focus on. And I've talked to my family again and, and we'll see how this goes. I Today's a holiday. I'm just doing this planning on Monday because yesterday I did the airport thing and got caught up in some other stuff. Um, and my husband called me at 9.05 when I said 9 to noon are my work hours. And he said, but it's a holiday. So anyway, <laughs> this is how it goes. I've already planned my month and you can see I put my goals over here. My brother's arriving for a visit. So I kind of marked that off with some washi. I used this planner sticker pack from Paper Studio, which is the Hobby Lobby brand. They're getting into planner stickers now and they have their own planner. So I used some stickers out of this. It's a really pretty and I thought it was very pretty for this. I will say to you, these look like they have a white backing or a colored backing, um, they're not. They're they're mostly clear, they're translucent at least. Um, so you can see this was a circle, there was no white backing, it's just clear all the way around these little hearts. Same thing with this here, and then this, you could see through that quite a bit. So just FYI, this is not quite what I thought it was going to be, but they're still really pretty. So I have everything marked off, I have my goals, I'm doing plant-based eating this month, I'm gonna try to work out three times a week. Um, I'm continuing with the Simply Clean plan, and I want to do a minimum of, three, minimum of three videos and three blog posts per week. And I will tell you that the blog posts are my downfall. I, it, the writing doesn't come easily to me, and so it, it takes, if something's going to go, that's always what I let go, and I need to stop that because that's not the way it should be. So let me take out this week, and as Per usual, I've taken my little handy dandy dollar spot um, weekly to do to do my pre planning that I purchased at the Target dollar spot. I pulled out some stickers and things that I want to make sure I use here. Um, and let's just get started. I'll show you what I've got going on. So I love these summer colors, so cute. And so I'm going to um, pull out these to do's and the todays, and I'm gonna do those across and kind of alternate them. Let's see, I've got five, six, and seven. I'm not going to lay down a lot of washi this week. I, you know, I, um, 
I really want to get my to-dos down and I really want to get this video planned and I want to get my week going. I want to actually accomplish the things I want to accomplish this week. And I need to be, um, I need to be more diligent with making sure people understand that just because I'm here during the day, every day, does not mean that I am just a free agent and I can do whatever. Sure, emergencies come up and I want to be available for those emergencies. I definitely want to be available for my family because I am the easiest one to be available. Let's face that. Um, but I also want to take this seriously. I want to get my Fun Stampers Journey business off the ground. I want to continue to do the YouTube videos. I have been ordering Fun Stampers Journey and um, I signed up as a coach in January. And I will tell you that of all the things I have ordered, there has not been one that I was like, you know what? That's not good quality. I can't, I can't promote that. No, there hasn't. I have loved everything that I've purchased so far. And when you join a company, and I've been with another direct sales crafty company, and that was not the case. There were things that I was like not that proud of. And um, I couldn't promote them. Now, there are things with Fun Stampers Journey that I'm not going to ever use. For instance, um, they sell planners. And they're beautiful Webster's Pages, Pages planners. But I don't use that type of planner. I don't use a little personal planner like that. I use a traveler's notebook as a wallet. And I use... Um, my happy planner, and then I've got the Recollections new spiral bound that I'm going to be using. But I like a bigger planner, and then I like my traveler's notebook for my wallet. So I will not be promoting that item because it's just not something I actually use. Even though it's good quality, like I said, it's Webster's Pages. Other people love them. It's not something I'm going to be, you know, saying, yay, you need this. But there are other products that I love. And I've been so pleased with the quality that I want to share them and I want to promote them and um, make sure other people know what great products these are, that they source as much as they can made in America. Now, there are things that aren't that they can't source in America. Unfortunately, there are things that we no longer make in America and so they can't. But everything that they can source in America, they do. And I love that. To me, that's really important with a company. So I want to promote it. I want it to be um, a business that I'm proud of. And so I'll be doing that. Okay, pink, blue again. You'd think I could rotate colors and talk at the same time, but um, <laughs> I have to think about it. <laughs> okay, so this section right here, these are my to-dos. These are the things I'm going to write in that need to happen this week. That's the way it is. They need to go on. I'm going to write up at the top my um, weather for the week, as I usually do. And let's see. All the way across. And it's going to be warm. And unfortunately, the weatherman is saying it's going to rain every day. That doesn't make me happy. But I guess this week... My nephew worked yesterday, Sunday. He doesn't work again until Friday. So that's, I don't have to get out, take him and pick him up. Um, his father arrives Saturday evening. So I'm thinking the following week when he's got a really busy work schedule, I'm going to leave that. I'm going to let his dad do that. Yeah. So um, that's one thing that can be taken off my plate. Um, let's see here. I know I have some little, um, let's see. I know I saw them. Little umbrellas. Where are they? Where are your umbrellas? Here we go. I'm going to put these umbrellas all the way across the top. Because, unfortunately, that's what's happening. <laughs> I hope the weatherman's wrong. Maybe I can peel some of these up and put a sunshine on one of the days, but... He's probably not. It's really gloomy and raining today, so he was right so far.
and today's Memorial Day, and I live in Texas, and I don't know if it's like this everywhere. It was not like this when I lived in Kansas, but we the firework stands op open for just about every holiday. Um, not Easter, thankfully, but just about every other holiday, and so my neighbors started shooting off fireworks Friday night. They've been going very late every night with the fireworks. It's making me really sluggish in the morning because I've been up listening to their fireworks all night long. Okay, so let's see what appointments I have. I'm not going to fill in all the filming and the, the household to-dos that I'm going to be doing because um, that's probably boring for you, but I have a lot of them. Down here at the bottom, I'm going to use this section down here as my health and fitness section for now. I am going to be using a recollection spiral binder for that starting in July, but it doesn't start till July. So we'll get our stuff down here because yes, I want to get all these to do's done. Yes. I want to promote my business. Yes. I want to make a go of it, but I also need to be healthy. I also really need to, um, keep track of other stuff and make sure I am taking care of myself because that's a big part of the battle, right? of getting anything accomplished in life is to make sure you're healthy and you are taking care of yourself. So I'm going to put my meal plans down here. I have a cousin. I don't know, is it second cousin when it's your cousin's child? Um, first cousin once removed? I don't know. But she um, is getting ready to go on maternity leave in order to supplement it. She's doing like meal plans for people. So I simply said, you know, Missy, I want to go plant-based. And I want, I don't like coconut very much, and I don't like raisins. And I want things to be simple. I want to be able to um, prepare them quickly because I'm just, I'm not cooking for a family. It's just for me. And I want to be able to throw things together. So she came up with a lot of smoothie recipes and things. And I went and did the grocery shopping last night. Um, she got that all to me yesterday. And so I went and did the grocery shopping last night. And um, I spent about $60 for breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks for an entire week for myself. And this morning I had my smoothie. It was tasty. And why can't I get this down straight? It was very tasty. I enjoyed it. And um, yeah, so I'm starting off and I'm going to track it every day. Make sure I stick to my plan. I might write my snacks in. I don't know what I'll do with the snacks, but, um, and then I want to work out on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. That's what I want to happen this week. Okay, up at the top, I do have some appointments and some things I need to remember. I have to, my son in law's coming back, so I have to pick him up at the airport. Let's see here, Wednesday, I believe. Yes, he gets in at 1 30. So I'm gonna put this at the pineapple so everything matches. Too cute, huh? Sometimes these things are super sticky. <laughs> And I can't reposition them, which you know I have to do because I am not good at getting things straight the first time, especially not on camera. Okay, so let's put chains arrives 1.30 p.m. Okay, um, let's see here. What else do I have? Oh, my nephew works Friday, Saturday, Sunday. He works um, from 2 to 10. So, hmm, what should I do for that? Let's do this one that says note. Just, to, just so I'm pulling from this whole, this is one of the seasonal ones, and it's the summertime looking ones, which I love. Love the colors. So let's put cam 2 to 10 p.m. And I also have some night vision issues. And so 
I probably should not be the one picking him up, but I am. I make him drive home, but I have to get there. 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, Okay, let's put this sweet land of liberty here on Memorial Day. I think it's important to remember what this day is all about. And let me see, I need a quote for this week. I need something to keep me going this week. Don't stress, do your best, forget the rest. Nope, that's not it. She loved life, I don't love to write back. Hmm. Start each day with a grateful heart. It's where the fun stuff happens. No, I need something like, okay, here, this one. She turned her can'ts into cans and her dreams into plans. I'm going to put that over here. That's a big quote. That's perfect for this week. I really need to turn my plans, my dreams into plans this week. I really need to get it done. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching and listening to me ramble on. <laughs> I hope you all have a great week planned, and I hope you're going to accomplish the things you need to accomplish and the things that are important to you. Happy planning, everybody.